In this video, we're doing a virtual microphone comparison of some legendary mics. A microphone shootout, if you will. <laughs> Say it with me now. I love microphones. Come on. If you're like me, a DIY musician working out of a home studio, you have a limited budget, but you still want that experience of what it feels like to work with a magical mic locker, right? As DIY producers and engineers, we want to train our ears and develop our instincts to make excellent gear decisions that optimize our recording. The best way to do that without access to the hardware is with modeling mics like this one here, the ML1 from Slate Digital. For instance, I auditioned several famous microphone and preamp models for this dialogue bit here before choosing the giant 44 style ribbon microphone and a vintage German tube preamp model. In doing so, I got to practice using my ears to hear the subtle variations and to use my instincts in selecting the right sound for my project. For this comparison, I recorded a short acoustic guitar loop and a short vocal loop. Now I used a touch of corrective EQ before or going into the virtual mix rack software to account for the room that I'm recording in. But I didn't use any other compression or effects for the audio comparisons. And then I chose the Hollywood preamp for the acoustic guitar examples and the London preamp for the vocal examples. And I processed all of the audio at the same level. I auditioned six mics for the acoustic guitar, the FG-12 and the FG-251, the B-12 and the B-251 from the Blackbird expansion, and then the FG-44 and the FG-37A from the Classic Tubes 3 expansion. And then I auditioned an additional six microphone models for the vocals, the FG-47 and the FG-67, the B-47 and the B-67 from the Blackbird expansion, and then the Mark II versions of the 47 and 67 from the Classic Tubes 3 expansion. At the end of the comparisons, I'll tell you which ones that I like the best, and I'll use them in a mix made using only plugins from the Slate Digital all access pass. If you don't have these expansion packs yet, now is the perfect time. Slate Digital is running a sale through February and you can pick them up at a huge discount. Check out the bundle to save even more. As you'll hear, the expansions really increase the tonal versatility that you can get with your ML1 microphone. Now, real quickly, before we get started, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Roth Conrad. Malleus Incus Stapes is my music project. And pretty much what I do is I mess around with songs here in my home studio and I learn things. I've been doing it for about three years now. I started during COVID and I'm making videos and practicing and sharing as I go. I do cover songs. I write original songs and then I produce and mix for myself and for other artists. Then I make session logs and gear comparison videos like this one of what I'm learning behind the scenes as well. If that's something that you're into, I'd love to have you join me. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel or follow me over on Instagram. It's at m.i.stapies and leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Okay. Okay, let's get started. You'll want to listen several times and use the timestamps or video controls to jump around. And be sure to listen with good headphones or studio monitors in a well-treated room. I mean, wow, how cool is that? 
These mic models allow you to audition several tonal qualities from a single take recording and let you choose which one works best for the current project that you're working on. Each mic model has its own unique flavor that will shine on different sources depending on your sonic scenario. In this case, for the acoustic guitar and the song and the sound that I was hearing in my head, I liked the FG-12 the least and I liked the B-251 the most. The FG-44 was a close runner-up for me, but there was just something about the bass and the low mids in that B-251 that absolutely nailed it. Which was your favorite? Let me know in the comments. Okay, let's check out the vocals. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. Now you can't go wrong with any of these. 47 and 67 style microphones are simply fantastic. And I really love the versatility that we get here with the expansion packs because we get to choose from three different 47 style microphones and three different 67 style microphones. For this song and my voice, it was the FG67 Mark II from the Classic Tubes 3 expansion that really grabbed me with just the perfect mojo for the occasion. Which mic did you like best for my vocals? Let me know down in the comments. And with that, here's the final results mixed together using only plugins from your All Access Pass. Thanks for watching, thanks for commenting, and I'll see you next time. Cheers. And like a dream, her true beauty conquered every heart between the beating stop and the beating start. While light her feet, light pines the feet us. All its power straight quivered into flower, but nothing would ever help her out of her lonely as stars.